Welcome back. In this week's Animal Answers, we're going on a field trip. For some, it might be a trip to the park, museum, or movie theater. But as you're about to see, one group of second graders are becoming pond scientists. I think if you start kids at an early enough age, they'll have a, an appreciation for the outdoors. Every year as June rolls around, I learned kiddos have the tendency to be timed out in the classroom. Baby mosquitoes, lots of those. This group of Barnum bombers, there's lots of different baby animals, is now learning everything they need to know about tiny critters all around us. Frogs make lots of different sounds. If we can get any of these kids interested in, in the outdoors, then they're going to become the stewards of, of the next generation. For environmental education intern Matt Wiley. Animals come in a lot of different sizes and shapes. A love of learning and exploring the outdoors. We're catching a lot. Drew him into his first year at Hartley Park. Everyone's always kind of attracted to the big, cool stuff. Becoming hooked on lions, tigers, bears, and more. Wiley says young students often forget about creatures so critical to our ecosystem. They might not be as exciting as a bear or a wolf, but they're definitely just as important to the ecosystem as everything else. Grabbing the nets and digging through the water to find different sorts of animals. Gallons of water encompassing life lessons right here in our backyard. It's a great opportunity for them to come on a field trip to Hartley and put some of that stuff they've learned um, into action and to get their hands on those things that they've been talking about. Action, helping this group of second graders find answers to life Whoa. and science. It was just a lot of fun and there's a lot of people who teach you about it. Oh, now, Hartley will be offering school field trips for a few more weeks, then transition into summer camp. If you would like to learn more or get involved at Hartley Nature Center, visit our website, fox21online.com.